Okay, good morning. Um, now, I found this interesting site. I've just pulled up. Um, I'm just around the corner from Mungu Beach. I was just at that yoga place, if you see the last video, and then before that I was having a bit of a ramble on the beach when it was raining. Now, it looks pretty interesting. It's definitely an architectural build, right? So I've just rolled up here. Obviously, there's some footings here and some steel going on. Let's go for a walk in here because this is the bit that caught my eye that I'll have a look at. So, uh, uh, hey, all right, yeah, 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 cool, cool. See, they're all cool, man. Yeah, builders, builders. <laughs> See, this is this is nice with the camp. Yeah. There, you've got the camp in there. So, they've got all the expensive torts I can see there and lids, you know, you've got to keep all them away. That's where they camp, so that's the tool shed there. That looks like the smoke our room. Yeah. You working today? No work? Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, yeah? yeah. Okay, cool. Mm. Smoke Yeah. No, it's smoke Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, here we go. We've got a bit of a drawing here. <laughs> Well, that's a, uh, okay, well, can you see that? That's a floor plan, so obviously there's two pools in the place. Big, nice dining. Um, so who's the architect here? Ultra Indonesia. Okay. That's probably, probably what they're working off. So you've got a one, two, three, four better. A four better. Four bathrooms. Uh, anyway, won't keep you up like that. So, okay. So there's another camp in there. Go, yeah. yeah, mate. All right. <laughs> okay. Now look at the. Oh, it's nice. It's nice. Yeah. <laughs> done a bit similar, similar style. I've done this in Melbourne actually. It's nice, big, high ceilings. That's a beautiful uh, timber roof. Clip, clip system. You can see there. I oh, know it's pin, pin. Okay, you can see here. So this is a definitely a, a bedroom here. You can see by the sockets there. Oh wow, wow, wow. Have a look at this. They're doweling the floorboards. Look at that. Can you see that? I'll, I'll bring you closer. See those dowels? Maybe that's a bit better. Doweled and glued. Oh, that is what it's about. That's perfection. Right? Oh, there is some screws in some places. Oh, no, no, no. This is not doweled. Okay. It's even trickier, but nice. No one, I've never seen that before. No one would dowel, dowel the floor like that. Um, so what it has been, it's been screwed off and someone's paying big bucks for this because this is what architects do and I'm going to do this on my build next time for sure because uh, obviously you've got the materials and the labour that can do it here. So let me just show you here. So it's screwed, pre-screwed. You can see there's one of the screws there that's countersinking. There's a steel frame under it. Um, this frame hasn't been painted. I'll, I'll put a lick of paint on that just to seal the steel. But So the counter sunk quite deep. Okay, let's see, we've got an off cutter dowel here. No, we haven't. Okay, so the counter sunk quite deep, if you can see that. Doweled in there, they're glued, knocked off, and then when that sands and finish, wow, they look Mickey Mouse. So instead of having screw heads, um, they will be um, a beautiful, different coloured timber dowel, which is really, that's what it's about. You're going to build something, you know, this is what you want to do. Take it to that next level. It's a beautiful, beautiful finish. So, oh, look at this. I walk right past it. I just get so excited. Can you see those trees, right, um, coming through? Okay, obviously through, penetrating through the floorboards, up through the ceiling space, um, and through, and they've, they've, oh, come, let's have a look. I love, you know, I love design, good design in the environment. This is special, this place. Oh, it's special. Far out. Look at this, baby. Hey. So look at that nice detail around there, nice and coping, and they've done there, they've flashed it up there, hey? Look at that, look in your master bed, here's another guy there, hey? This is what a good architect does, he designs around, you just don't cut down trees. Look at this, okay, well, we've got a nice, here's a nice big pivot door, now it's, it's wedged in, I won't move it, but anyway, look at that. Solid, solid timber, and that's a nine foot ceiling, actually probably ten foot. Bit of bathroom, I might take your hands a bit dark. So let's go out here. So as I looked on the floor plan before, this is the main living area. That's the kitchen. Okay. Formal sort of dining area. And then there's another sort of, that's a couchy area over there. And this is another sort of, there was three sections to this as they had it in the plan. Who knows what we're going to put there. But here's the aspect. Look at the aspect. You can hear the waves crashing. You can hear the waves crashing just over there. I oh, probably can't hear him on the video, a bit dark there, okay. Look at this, okay, lovely pool, look at this aspect, this is just your entertaining space, sitting out here having your barbecues, drinking your beers, 
overlooking the, the rice paddies. Um, this would be worth a small fortune, probably. Um, I'm not too impressed with that steel work right there. Right, it's pretty light. I'd beef that up, put some big stringers through that. There's a lot of load on that. And you can see they haven't, um, they haven't primed all that steel, which is not good in these conditions. Um, rust, you know, that's, I'll give that not much of a life before that starts effing up. And look, let's go through why. If you go through all that detail, see those dowels? You can see, I don't know if you can see the dowel. If you're gonna do all that, you may as well make the subframe bloody strong. Now even the spans, I'm a bit concerned with the spans here. I'm also, I'm, I'm tempted to ring up the architect and say, who's, who's B's looking at this job? Look at those spans, it's only inch by inch steel. I'm, I'm not, it's a bit long, it's a bit, there's, they're about a, probably a 1200 centre um, in between the berries. I don't like that. Um, anyway, let's not get caught up on that. So, uh, yeah, look, okay, so it comes around here. It is three better. That's the floor plan I looked at before. There's two, two parts to this, so that must be like a, another section. So this would be the master bed here. So, master bed. Oh, pretty nice. Love the high ceilings. I'd be interested to see what kind of door um, glass mechanism they have here. So that would be your view. Oh, I can't really see that well. Let's go and have a look at the master bar. Okay, master bar. Okay, this would be a walk-in. Okay, either side, probably his and hers. So, you know, get your clothes, come on through. Okay, obviously bar style. This is the shower or gonna be a bath area here. Big open plan, they'll probably grab food or something in there. Probably could have done a bit more with this bathroom. It's a bit, bit too modern and boring. And the cabinetry's out of whack too. But anyway, no, let's not pick on the place. Love the ceilings. Stairs in bathrooms, they know about it. I like to have a level, I'd put that level through there. I don't know what the architect was doing there. Maybe he was just trying to get a different aspect with that windowy thing. Um, like this, this is probably, this would be some sort of formal entry there. You can see those stairs over there. All right. Um, we've done a really good job on this render work. Hope that. Okay, that's Hebel behind there. Hebel's like an air raided block they use in here. You can sort of hear it. Hear that ding, ding, ding difference here? So um, this would be finished like this. So this is a nice um, rendered finish. So just put a, something over that. Here's another big bed. This is a big, a big bedroom. Far out. They're huge. I'll make it a little bit smaller, I still like them. So obviously, here's a whole, oh these are two separate villas. This is, okay, I won't, uh, yeah, these are two completely separate villas. That would be a master villa, and this would be, I don't know, a baby villa or something. Anyway, I won't carry on for too long. Um, three videos in one day, that's my record. I'm having a really good morning. Uh, it's, uh, yeah, adventuring, adventuring around. So there you have it, um, the villa. I don't know, I'll look it up and I'll get back to this place. There's a few places I'll get back to, but I'll get back to this one. Okay, bye-bye. Catch you later. Happy Friday again. <laughs>